Okay, YouTube users, this is Nemo Skull at rcgross.com coming to you with my latest machination. This is a servo. This is a standard RC hobby servo. I got this at hobbyking.com. This one goes for $4. It weighs 1.9 grams and is a 90 degree servo. It's being run by a Arduino Nano 168 um, from a very old USB ASP using a uh, Linux Ubuntu version of Arduino and this is basically all that it does. This um, I get a full 90 degree sweep out of this using just standard Arduino analog in so I got a 1023 a bit 1023 value va variable um, so I can this you know 0 1023 I then took this and I turned it into a delay using this value of the analog in. So when you add a one millisecond delay in front of that, you got your standard servo pulse of one millisecond to two milliseconds with 1.5 being in the middle. And that's all this is right now. This is very simple. I had to add a delay of 16 milliseconds at the end. This is not quite kosher. Usually they're like 22 milliseconds and this thing does not like to run at 22 milliseconds delay. Um, all my other servos do. This one likes 16 milliseconds. Again, this is very rough and this is just a very prototype that I threw together in the last half an hour or an hour. And um, this, I get 90 degree sweep. You can actually push this and get more. You should be able to get um, close to 180 degrees, uh, probably in the area of like 145 or something, but that requires uh, fancy math on this side because you need more than a simple 1000 value that variable. Uh, you'd, you'd actually have to increase the range from uh, from 0.8 milliseconds up to 2.3 milliseconds, which it can handle it, but it's very close to the stops. And these servos do have a tendency to burn up when they're overloaded physically uh, for too long a time. It's never happened to me though, uh, but it is what it is. This is going to go, uh, well, never mind, I'll tell you that later. And that's that.